Uh, so the coaches have kind of talked about a lot about, um, you know, since you got that opportunity when Jalen was hurt, a chance to kind of play regularly. Uh, you've you've shown a lot and you've improved a bunch. Just how have you feel your game has improved maybe from when you arrived on campus earlier this year to where you are now? Um, I just most definitely first thing I did was just get comfortable. I got real comfortable with the play call. I got real comfortable with my teammates, even though I have been here since the spring. But, you know, just sinking in, selling in, and really, really just buying into the culture. And then what's it been like, They, you know, because Jalen played left tackle last year. They moved him, move him inside when you come on the field. Um, Just what's it like playing next to him? How much does he help you, you know, as a guy who's a veteran? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It made my job a lot easier, but – um. I would definitely think uh, whoever was in there, if Matt McCoy was in there, uh, whether Jalen Rivers was in there, whether I was playing beside Nez Cooper, you know. I mean, I have faith in those guys, and those guys have faith in me, so make a good combination. Next, we'll go to Azubi Charles at Canesport. Azubi? Hold on, Marco. Just wanted to ask you about, you know, playing with a quarterback like Cam Ward, a guy you know, that has the ability to keep plays, you know, going on for a long time, extend, and just his playmaking ability in general. Oh, yeah, man. Um, it was definitely a blessing. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, w w whenever we pass protecting, we we have no clock in our head. So, and we know we know the type of person he is. We know the type of player he is. So, he can extend the drive for however long you need to, whatever it takes to get done. You know. We'll go back to Adam Lincoln seeing the sunset. Hey again. Uh, so I just asked Cam this a minute ago, but um. You know, you guys obviously, you know, got the the number four ranking last night in the CFP rankings. Just how much has it been a uh, priority among the team or a focus with the team to basically just like not let that the outside stuff, the rankings, all that, you know, phase you guys? Yeah, man, we just we just taking it one game at a time, you know, and it it all starts with practice and preparation. I mean, that's been our biggest focus. We're not focused about the outside, no. We're not focused about the praise. We 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 actually ignore the praise and focus on our flaws we have as a team and as an individual. Our next question comes from Matt Shadella Canesport. Matt. Yeah, hey, Markel. Can you just talk a little bit about uh, the Georgia Tech defense and what you see with them? Yeah, they're, they're most definitely a, talent, a talented defense. Um, Coach Chris Ball commented on them, and he was saying that they were a good complement complementary of football team, so they complement each other. And, you know, offense, defense, special team. So, I mean, I just think we have to, as a team, as a team, we just have to lock in, you know, keep doing the same. Doing the same old, same old. Just keep executing. Next, we'll go to Marcus Benjamin at Canes County. Marcus? Hey, Mark. How's it going? Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, sir. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to ask about just your progression uh, through the season. What's been the toughest uh, trends? Uh, I guess, what's what have you learned the most, I guess, from game one? Uh, to now, like what 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 has been the hardest transition for you? Oh uh, well, really from game one to now, I'm just really like just learning myself as a player, you know, uh, figuring out my own, own flaws and my own strengths, and you know, I'm just attacking it every day at practice and with the help of Mir Coach Mirabal and Coach Chris Ball with everybody, even even my teammates, you know, they tell me something that I need to work on, so I'm gonna go work on it the next day or the same practice, you know. Yeah, hey Bobby. Um, I know it's your your first year, obviously. So I just want to get a sense of your progress. What you think you've improved the most as this season's gone along? Uh, what I improved the most as the season going along is like being more vocal and being where I'm supposed to be at. Like being early on time. Like be there first. Like to be more vocal and more and just having fun with it too. So like to be be a bigger lead, a better leader. That's it. Next, we'll go to Adam Lichtenstein of the Sun Sentinel. Adam, hey Bobby, how's it going? How you doing? Good, good. Um, so I guess just you know, how how have you seen you know yourself and, and some of the other you know freshman defensive players uh, like start to improve kind of as the season's gone on? And you guys had had more chances to like uh, work and practice and stuff. Uh, I see ourselves like you know, little bit more reps, getting more reps. Uh, we have been working very hard. The whole team have been working very, very, very hard. Like we try and go one on one on every day. We started the practice field, so we just try and prove ourselves and uh get better and help the team out. And just you know, how how have things been going for you and your sorry if you can hear a text tone going off, but um, you know, 
how have you seen you know yourself improve a bit? You know, uh, when you get getting a chance to play uh, over the last couple months. Uh, I seen myself improve just following the older guys like Kiko, Wesley, Jaden Allman, Chase Mill, all all the se- like all the seniors and leadership council. I just follow them around, try to be in their pocket, try to do what they do, and uh, go work every day and give a hundred percent every day. Next, we'll go to Azubi Charles, a cane sport. Azubi. What's going on, Bobby? Just wanted to ask you about, you know, that fumble recovery. You kind of run me through that play and what was going through your mind where you're trying to, you know, take it back to the crib? Uh, I got a score. To, I got a score to down. As uh, he's filling my hands, I said, oh, I got to make a play. But turned out I couldn't make it how I want to make it. But still a good turnover. Uh, credit to uh, the defense line, for personal quarterback, and my teammates for just being there. Doing their job. 